Hey, what's up guys? Adam here. Today I'm going to be talking about iOS 5.0.2 as well as iOS 5.1. So these are two firmware updates that have not been announced by Apple, however they are rumored very heavily and a lot of websites including Mac Rumors and 9to5Mac have been reporting on what they're supposedly going to be. So starting with iOS 5.0.2, this is supposedly going to be an update kind of like iOS 5.0.1 which recently came out within the last few weeks and it's supposedly going to be fixing the battery life issue once again on the iPhone 4S. Now the reason why my phone is at 1% right now because I'm not charging it is because I wanted to demo the usage and the battery life on 5.0.1 I thought this would be a great period when I'm at 1% and pretty much as you can see here I have 3 hours and 55 minutes of usage and 10 hours and 11 minutes of standby and as you can see there that's not really too much for the phone to be at 1% Apple supposedly did fix the battery life issue with iOS 5.0.1, but unfortunately it didn't really get fixed. Hopefully they make the battery life even better in 5.0.2. Now moving along, iOS 5.1. This is supposedly going to be an update to Siri pretty much, and it's going to add a lot more control to Siri. So for example, if I do commands such as open Safari. So if I do commands such as telling my phone to do something like, uh, you know, toggle airplane mode, take a picture, open an app, it says this, I can't open that app for you, Adam, my apologies. Which is pretty annoying if I have to say so myself. I mean, why can't Apple just implement this? It'd be pretty cool. Uh, but with iOS 5.1, there's been a lot of reports that this is going to be the update. Siri's going to add this functionality to open different applications, uh, you know, take pictures, as well as uh, do different toggles such as Wi-Fi, airplane mode, and all of that. Anyways guys, that's my video on iOS 5.0.2 and iOS 5.1. I'm really looking forward to both of the updates and hopefully they should be coming out within the next few months. Anyways guys, thanks all for watching.